Whoa, another garden. Really? Nope. Are you kidding me? Honestly, like, the whole experience has been awesome so far. We haven't even ate the food. Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to On The Road Us. This is your girl Desiree. This is your boy Miguel. And we are back on another adventure. If you saw the video from last week, you saw that delicious lobster roll that we destroyed. Yes. It was so good. And if you haven't so actually, um, click this uh, little link right here and it'll take you straight to the video. Uh, but don't forget to come back so you can watch this one. We have something very exciting for you guys today. Um, you want to tell them? So today, I'm actually a little bit nervous because yeah. I've never tried this before. Me too. But today, we're actually going to try an Indian restaurant. Mm -hmm. For the first time, we're both going to try Indian food. And um, I'm very excited to see what it's all about, you know? Yeah, we're mixing it up a little bit. We don't really know what to expect or what to do. Um, if you guys have ever tried Indian food before, comment below, let us know what your favorite dish is. Hopefully next time we'll try that. Oh, sorry. Okay. Yeah, next time we'll try that. Sorry about that. And, um, so, should we, uh, check it, check, blah, 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 blah. So. <laughs> so, Miguel's a little bit, uh, nervous today. He can't talk, yes. but. Anyways, um, we did do a little bit of research on this restaurant. Like I said, we've never tried this before, so mm -hmm. we just wanted to make sure we got a nice place. Um, good reviews. Yeah, some good reviews. There is some bad ones too. There Every are. place is good and bad. But um, we'll read to you guys a few reviews here that we found. Do you, you want to go first? The... Yes. Yeah, I'll go first. Okay, you go. All right, so I, I will it. read. Um, this one is five stars, so I guess I'll read the good review. And it says, amazing food. We drove 30 minutes for a pickup order. They also have a really great safety set up inside with masks and gloves when you pick up your order. Thank you and stay safe. So, nice and short, nice. you know, but it's very important, uh, especially around, uh, you know, this time that you're extremely safe um, and that not only you're safe, but your clients <clears throat> feel safe coming into the restaurant. Mm -hmm. um, you know, because you are dealing with food, so you want to make sure that you're wearing gloves, you're wearing masks, and you know, everyone feels comfortable. Yeah, that's good. It's important. Mm -hmm. um, I'll read a bad review here. It's one star, and it says, I'd like to be able to write a review of this restaurant, but I can't. It's confusing. Last week we attempted to place an order, but we couldn't. Can't place a takeout order via voicemail. Can't find a way to do this online. We left two voicemails about this, but didn't get a response. So if the restaurant can find a way for us to place a takeout order, I'd certainly like to know how to do it. Hmm. Interesting. So yeah, really talked about the customer service, which is something that we always look into. Yeah, big time. Um, it's interesting, but it is from two months ago, so yeah. it is when Corona was a little bit more active. It was at its peak. Yeah. yeah. So maybe they were close for Corona. Yeah, that's true. I don't know. On their website too, um, or it could have. Been, I don't know if it was because of the review, but um, they are open for lunch and they're open for dinner. So they, they are closed for two to three hours in, during the day. So, I mean, it could be that too, but you know, who knows? Well, cross your fingers and hope they pick up for us. Yes, if they don't, then we're gonna make another video <laughs> <laughs> about something else. Or maybe another Indian restaurant we'll choose. Yeah. yeah. All right, guys, well. Um, so this place we're going to is called Indian Garden. Indian Garden. And check out the menu, guys. We'll take yeah. a look and order online. The menu is like I mean, very wonderful. intense. Like there's just so many choices, um, you know, and it, it's it's legible too, which is really nice because it gives you like a good description of what there is uh, yes. to be expected. So um, if you haven't already, please subscribe. And if you are new here, and give us a thumbs up for yeah. trying Indian food for the first time. I don't know what to expect, but 
I hope it's delicious. I think it's gonna be good, you know, but let's see. What are you see. doing, making a fire? I don't know, mixed, I'm nervous. I mean, I'm ne I've never tried Indian food before. Like, all right guys, we'll so we'll catch you on the ride there, all right? Bye. Hey look, it's a garden center. Isn't that funny? Cause it's called Indian garden and then there's a garden. Mm. From it? Um, it's actually four miles away. Like my Whoa, another garden. Really? Nope. <laughs> are you kidding me? <laughs> Alright guys, we just got here, so we are gonna Your destination is show on the you what it's like. So this is the spot right there. Did they come out to you? Oh, I'm not sure. They might actually come out to you guys. Yeah, there you go. Wow. This phone number is 0988, right? Yes, 0988. Yes. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. Wait, how do we tip? I don't know if we can tip. Seriously? Oh, man, I'm so bummed out. I, I feel so weird calling them again and be like, hey, like, can you put a tip on there? But, like. Sure, thank you very much, sir, for Th that. Thank you, have a good day. Thank you, you're good, thank you. Thank you, Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, I feel bad, because, I mean, they didn't, see, honestly, like, the whole experience has been awesome so far. We haven't even ate the food. Alright, I'm so excited. I can't mm, wait. You can kind of smell it already. Mmm, it smells like carne asada. Oh wait, we got chicken. It smells like chicken. pollo rostizado. Yeah. Actually, that's why I ordered mine. Because, so... Obviously, I don't know what a lot of the things were on the menus, so I was just googling what the description that sounded interesting. I just googled it to see what it looked like. Yeah, that's a good idea. And what I ordered looks like pollo rostizado, so that's why I got it. Cheater. I didn't google mine. Oh, well. Well, I can't wait to try yours, too. Huh? One thing I hate when I order food, like I hate being a nuisance. Like I hate like calling, like I called them like three times. We called them to order. We called them to ask if we should go in and come out. And we also called to No, and you tip. called when they called you back, remember? When you called back. Oh yeah, and I called them back. So I already spoke, I already called that place four times today and not once did it go to a voicemail. That's so, true. So, you know, I just wanted to touch base on that because of the review. So we're back home. Let's open this up and let's see what Indian food tastes like. Let's check it out. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Alright. The first thing, it kind of looks like a tortilla. Wow. It looks like a fat tortilla. Yeah, it looks like. I don't know what it tastes like. I don't know. Oh, here. We'll put this over here just so you guys can. Uh, Nice. What's that? Whoa, empanadas. dumplings or empanadas. No, I think those are called. Um, those are the samosas, mimosas. Yeah. Samosas, mimosas. I think that's what they are. Okay, what else? What else do we have in here? Wow, two sauces. Green. Why is that one so dark? And I don't know. Looks kind of spicy though. So you could try that one out. <laughs> Why do you give them to me? Wow. Ooh, that looks told so you. It's good. like pollo rostizado. Yeah, look at this chicken, guys. Looks delicious. Yummy. This, I think this is. Well, I don't know. It might I be what you ordered nice. in mine. That's, this is what Google told me it would look like. So. Oh, you already knew. That's cheating. What is that? Yeah, wow. almonds in there, and pasas. Wow. And what else? Oh, and chicken, I guess. Oh my God! It's like overflowing. A lot. Wow, that looks delicious. Next. What else is in that tiny bag? I feel like so much stuff's coming I out. I know. Mm. 
some saucy sauce. What is this? Ooh, rice. Looks so good. You know, candy without my oh rice. Oh my god. Mm, we'll put those this looks over there. Bomb. Yeah, it looks so freaking delicious. All right, so you ready to dig in? Mm-hmm. Been ready. So I think I'm gonna try the chicken biryani. Um, hope I'm saying that right. I mean, ready to try some? Yeah. Oh see. wow. What is that chicken? Big piece of chicken. Should I just eat the whole thing? Yeah. What does it taste like? Wow. Oh my god. So the chicken just tastes like it's like cooked so well and mm -hmm. it's seasoned. I've never really I've never even had these seasons before. Yeah. It just it's so weird. I felt like I just as soon as I took a bite into it, like I felt like my mouth was just like filled with the smell. Yeah, it was it was crazy. Hmm, interesting. So my wow. chicken's a little bit red all over. I guess it's from the seasoning. Mm -hmm. It's pretty yummy. Yeah. I'll try it out. And the skull tandoori, tandoori. chicken. Mm. It's very juicy. Mm. Tastes like chicken. <laughs> you want to try one of mine? Sure. The whole chicken though? Yeah. Or not. <laughs> you want to? Mm. Right? It's just so much spices. Like, I don't even know what kind of spices they use. I did taste. That's true. The nuts, I don't know what kind of nuts it was. Like okay. almonds. Almonds, yeah, I did taste them. Um, wow, let me get this nice piece of onion right here too. Is it good? This is probably like my new favorite meal right now. Like, it's just, it smells really good. And as soon as you bite into it, like whatever you're smelling, like you just, you can taste you it. You can just taste it. It's just crazy. It's like this plate. Like I haven't tried that yet, but this plate. Yes. I feel like you smell it, you taste it, and like both things it. just hit you at the same time. Like it's, it's yeah, it's, it's definitely crazy. very flavorful. Yeah, and and it's the aroma is just so strong. It is true. This is banging. Oh. I'm gonna try these things. Whatever. Samoas, whatever. Look like empanadas. We're eating the appetizer next. Hmm. It tastes like empanada. I'm gonna try the sauces, but I don't know which sauce to use. Looks like veggies. I'm gonna try the sauce. Potato maybe? I don't know. Yeah, it's definitely veggies in here. It's definitely like potatoes, um, peppers, peas. peas. You know what's crazy though? So the way that the dough tastes, mm -hmm. it's like, it gives it like a really sweet, um, it just tastes really sweet. Like I know when you taste like empanadas and stuff like that, or like other pastelitos and stuff, it's like not really that sweet, but like, this is. What does that taste like? Let's dip it in. Tastes like curry. Tastes like curry. I can smell it. What is that? I think it's like a yogurt sauce. Is it sweet? Mm mm. It smells like coleslaw. It smells like yogurt and cucumber or something like that. Yeah, definitely tastes like cucumber. 
That was really refreshing, actually. Let's try this right here. Green sauce. I'm kind of scared to try that. Go Eagles, go. This is actually a little spicy, not gonna lie. It smells like minty, very minty. Mm -mm. <laughs> nope. That tasted like, it was weird. That, that tasted like, like I was still enjoying my Samoa, Samosa, but like had gum in my mouth. Yeah, I don't like that one that much. Oh. Are you gonna try the last one? Let's try the mole. Spicy? I didn't try it yet. Oh, you had a face like, I was about to dunk the whole thing. Well, in I there. don't know what it tastes like. Try it. it. I thought you tried it. It does kind of smell. Hmm. The first taste is sweet. Yeah. Mm hmm. You think it's gonna be like spicy, but then again, it kind of does look like barbecue. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, whatever. The, the consistency is like kind of thick. Mm -hmm. That's good though. Wow. What the? Oh, no, I just had. I was like a little piece of that just fell in there. Guys, I've never had, you know, Indian food before. And I regret not eating it before because it actually tastes really good. Mm hmm. Wow. It's definitely a lot of flavor. We're going to wrap it up and we're going to go over the four categories that we rate every experience by. I know we haven't done it for the last two videos, but it's time to go back to that. We'll start with category number one, food quality. The food quality was banging. I mean, everything is cooked thoroughly. Sometimes you can eat certain foods that are not cooked thoroughly, whether it's like the appetizer or, you know, especially when you order a lot of stuff. I feel like they have a bigger chance of getting one little thing wrong if you order, you know, four or five Hey, they didn't things. forget anything. They didn't forget my tater tots. <laughs> yeah, they forgot my tater tots the last place. I didn't like it. I mean, my experience was just horrible after that. It's just like, yo, the burger was on point, but if you forget my tater tots, like, you know, it's I'm not, not even hungry, hungry anymore. I'm kind of pissed now that I think about that. I can't All right, let's that move story. on. Yeah, let's move on. So, number two. Bang, bang. Number two is service. I have to say, service was amazing. Mm -hmm. Even though we didn't eat at the restaurant, the service was totally amazing from how they picked up the phone to them calling us back and letting us know that the food was ready. Mm -hmm. um, I've never had that happen before, so that was good. And then them bringing the food out to us, putting it in the car, like no contact at all. It was awesome. Definitely, I would give it a 10 for the service. Mm -hmm. Category number three, which is ambiance. From the outside, it looks, it looks clean. There was two doors also. I don't know if you noticed. There's one door where some customers were going in and out, and there was the other door that only that one lady was coming out of. Oh, to really? To get food, yeah. So oh. ambience, I haven't, I should have went inside, guys. Maybe when this whole corona thing's over, I'll go inside there. Um, but the ambience was uh, I, uh, undetermined. Yeah. Last category? Um, Last category, which is pricing. I think it was 40, under $40 for the whole everything, which was two very big meals. Huge meals. Um, the appetizer mm -hmm. comes with lots of sauces, the bread, and dessert. Try it out, guys. Yep. In New Garden in Yarley, PA. Mm -hmm. Or try any of these dishes at all, you know. Yeah. I'm sure you're really going to like them. Sure. Um, but thanks a lot for stopping by again. We will see you guys next week. We'll catch you guys next time. Stay safe. Peace. And eat lots of food.